on the Nerf Maverick. Nerf's most recognizable blaster. But what I thought has always been missing is one of these. Hold on, let me take the barrel off of this. But this is a barrel attachment look. Yes, it is very, very simple. It's just something attaches to this. But the Maverick needed something, I felt. I needed a barrel attachment. I love all things Monster 2, just like Captain Xavier. And I thought, hmm, maybe you could put a barrel, modular barrel, barrel attachment lug onto a Maverick. So, that with the Maverick, we got this simple little barrel. Pretty wide. Maverick has pull trigger, barrel rotating, which is kind of a problem for making a barrel lug like this. So you gotta make the thing wide. So I thought I'd teach you guys some simple ways to make yourself a nice Maverick barrel attachment look. So let's do that today. I do want to mention though, it does also work on the strong arm. Not very well, but it still does work. As you can see, it works like that, but it might not always fire. If it actually, oh, see that. Well, actually, that was kind of my fault. I mean, it works sometimes, but that's fine. But I also, that's something I wanted to mention. It does work on the strong arm. But, so I thought today I'd teach you how to build one. For yourself. I know no one's going to be interested because my channel's basically dead. And the Maverick's pretty old. And that just went over there. But, um, I don't really know. Mine also is too old. That's, my that's both my Mavericks. I have two. So... I kind of wanted the matching barrel lug, but, but the tools you're going to need today, you're going to need, um, I don't think you might actually need this, but I guess a little pocket knife thing, mine just folds up, it also has a little flashlight, mine's just simple little thing, but you might need some pliers to pull out some stuff. You're gonna need wire cutters, or really anything that cut plastic, it doesn't really matter. A file, file down something. File down a piece of, you gotta file down this barrel, so. But, you're going to need some sort of barrel attachment. Something, I use so my, cause my regulator, this is the, the, the thing, I just gotta go grab it, one sec. The thing I used this from, got this from, was my regulator. I actually overvolted it by accident, and the thermos started getting issues and it wouldn't work, so I just stole this from it, and yeah, it works beautifully with the Maverick, actually, but this is a part of the regulator, one of the attachments that comes with the regulator, and since I mean, I guess I stripped the regulator for parts, might as well not, don't need every part of it, I mean, I still have one of them, and the stock too, which I love that stock, and that's just amazing. I could use the handle because it's useless now to me, really. But I'm um, infamous. But anyway, um, you're gonna remove this tube now. With the regulator one, you don't have to use the regulator. You can use any barrel that has like a lip, like this, this long, at least. Because I'm pretty sure. Well, you might want to file. No, actually, no. It's perfect. This one's actually shorter. But that's fine. Because I, I guess you could remove this little ring and make it perfect and flush with the blaster, but you don't have to. But these tabs, you're going to want to keep these. These, but you're going to actually cut them part of it off. But once you remove this, this the regulator part is solvent welded in. So I, I broke this part off. It sat like right here. And then I had to file some stuff down to make it good with so make sure it fits this if you're doing the regulator barrel it works just fine I had it cracked a little bit but um what you're gonna want to do is cut these tabs off now don't cut them off all the way as they're perfect like this and while they may fit into the maverick they're not gonna fit perfectly so what you're gonna want to do take your file file these down this will don't file down all the way because these this these will also allow you to nice like, friction fit it in there nicely sorry that my camera's wobbling my desk wobbles at the time my tablet might fall 
thing I'm using that holds it up is a screwdriver. Now, don't file these down all the way. Because it's these still do matter. Now press fit. I'm gonna have a upward explosion. Still need some filing. I'll be back with you when I'm done filing this. So okay, so I filed it down a little bit more. And it fits perfectly actually. And this time it's actually this this one is a little bit more flush with the blaster, so it's gonna look a little bit nicer, I think. So that's nice. So now it works perfectly. As you can see, it's very nice. Let's see if it works. Dart got jammed up, but that's probably the only reason it doesn't work is because some darts aren't very good. I got that. Some it depends on the dart, basically, because it's going to get caught. It's going to get caught kind of on... Here, yeah, there's this one. It's going to get kind of caught sometimes on this. It might. You might want to use ac more accurate type darts, like AccuStrike, or my favorite, and I would recommend it, the Desart... The, the Desart... <laughs> the Dart Zone... This dart, basically. The, just the, the, the Dart Zone Precise Pro. These things are freaking amazing. They're, like, accurate and powerful. So, oh, that one dart. So it's got a few misfires, but you get the idea. It's perfectly fine and it works good, I guess. I mean, if you wanted to do it better, you could probably, you could probably remove this. And yeah, that would work. Not bad. I'm gonna that down a little bit, but it works perfect for me. It's good enough. And now, yeah, I don't even know if it works on my storm arm, but it should. Ah, there, see? Perfect. Let's put the suppressor on it. That looks actually kind of cool. I'm not going to lie. But, it works good. Not the best, but it's pretty darn good if you had to ask me if I was making a barrel attachment, how I'd build it. I'd build it like this. Make it look cool. Yeah, I could work on the other one that I built, but hey, this one works. So, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in another video next time. Oh man, it jammed. Oh crap.